So look, bro. Um, right here we got like cops, live PD, all that up in one. You know what I'm saying? These videos be hilarious, and I don't care what y'all say. These videos be real. You can doubt some of the other ones, even though I ain't got the whole little. Uh, I don't be upset. I'm not directing it. I'm producing it. I don't know if it's scripts or not, but I can tell you, for real, for real, like authenticity. I can tell these be 100. You know what I'm saying? DJ Ghost merch. Link in the description if y'all support me. It's down there. Also, another 60 Days In episode. I didn't put on this channel, but I put on my other channel. That's in the description, too. Y'all can go watch that. If you're watching now, come back. Y'all can watch it later. If you did over look, if you do get over there, hit the notification bell, subscribe to the channel, and all that, because all that be supported. You know what I'm saying? I said all that be supported, all that be appreciated. I'm not finna hold y'all on that. Oh, girl. Here we go. He's uh, having a hard time with something here. Down at the world's longest beach. It's bro, in it time? Where's that at? Long Beach. You been drinking it all tonight? Yeah, I just cracked one right there. Why don't you, uh... Every time somebody say they just drunk one, I promise you, it's been like at least 12 or 13 of them. Do not let the cop get you when he say, hey, man, you know, uh, if you drunk, just tell me. It's fine, man. What you just have? One cocktail, one beer, one shot, whatever. As soon as you tell him one, DUI. And then if you right there, if you slurring your words and you look drunk, they ain't even going to give you that little breath a lot of thing. Like, he already admitted that he the, uh, that he the drunk something. And I already self-assessed that he's drunk, so therefore, put your hands behind your back. DUI. You Do go in the jail. Uh, sit tight for a second. All right. Sit tight for a second. These is already flash, uh, bro. You mean sit tight outside the car? Sit or tight. You're, you're parked yeah. here because... You know, we had a family vacation. Uh-huh. Oh, he was the parked. the longest beach. Now I'm driving home to Grandma Betty's house. How much you to drink today? Bro is faded. All he had to say was like, yeah, we went to the beach and we went to our grandma's house. He said, we had the world's largest beach. And then after that, we went to Grandma Betty house. Yeah, you went to Grandma Betty house, bro. You see, you, you, you being real, real, real careful with what you saying. And you going too much into detail. Why we got it? Why you, why you had to say her name was Betty? Why you had to say you was at the world's on? You're drunk. This hell, <clears throat> like faded. <clears throat> what about that? Not even half of water. Here you're up. <laughs> so, so what's your master plan? That's what he had to drink. He said I have a water. Oh no, <clears throat> Grandma Betty. Yeah, I'm doing no good. <clears throat> Grandma Betty, huh? If he was actually driving this car, he would be in her up for Grandma Betty, huh? driving under the influence, obviously. That's what I said. He had it parked, so. You got to keep on trucking. You know, might take some tests for us. I don't do very good with a test. Right. What is that? I don't know. I'm a pretty straightforward guy. <laughs> this address, we've had a lot of problems over there. We've had some weapons called. <laughs> I don't do pretty good with tests. Why? Cause I'm pretty. I'm a pretty fast, straightforward guy. Oh, I'm trying to keep it. Gets pretty what just happened? Hold on, hold on. Hold What's hold going on? on? Hold, on. hold on. What just happened? Oh yeah, there you go. My bad. Attacked him with the stick. No, I didn't. He. I was sitting in the room while y'all fought, sir. That's all I'm trying to. And he started screaming, "Get out of the house!" Why are you bleeding? <laughs> How you gonna say I was just in a, I was just in a room where y'all fought, but then you come out and you bleeding? Like, all right, so now who was in the room with you when you was fighting? Because you got down, bro. Stick. He beat okay. you with a stick. Raving crazy, mad man. He just goes raving crazy and starts. Going, Look at the house I tore it up, man. Are you whacked him with a stick? I had to. Okay. God, he scared me to death like he's gonna kill me. Uh. They've both been arrested. My husband's gonna jail. My brother attacked him. Please. Can't be beating each other with sticks. 
But my mother wanted to take my husband first. <laughs> tell me, tell me again. What were, I mean, what was the fight over? He plays this game called the Atomic Dove. Atomic Dove? On his phone. On his phone? Yeah. Okay. And that's all he lives for is this game. So two grown men, like, I'm not even going to say grown, man. They grown or they grown. They probably at least in their 50s, early 60s, bro. Late 40s, early 50s, I should say. Man, I was right the first time. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, and they all signed for to go to jail over a game on the phone. That's boyfriend, girlfriend stuff. Like, I don't see how this... How they... Game. Is it a phone game? Yeah. Were you fighting about the game? No, no. Oh, okay. No. Mm. It's just when you can't get up and get a job, I want him to move out of my house. Billy. Yes, sir. What's going on? What's going on? Well, actually, sir, no, nothing really was going on. I was sitting in the back room playing my phone game, Atomic Dove. If you look on my web, you'll see I played right up till it happened. Uh, okay. And he kind of jealous of that, you know. That He's he jealous of your phone? He jealous of his game on his phone. If you look on my web, did y'all to y'all too old for this, bro? And then y'all got a girlfriend, cause one of them said, "Don't take my or husband or wife, whatever it is, don't take him to jail." She like these dudes that this old that's playing games on their phones, bro. Now, it's, it's not even playing games on their phone. It's cool to play a game on your phone. But then y'all fighting over a game on your phone. That's when they end up in jail. Oh yeah, he's jealous of me playing the web. I'm one of the top top nations in the country. Why are you driving so fast? <laughs> you wanted to what? Hold on, how? I've been playing my phone game, Atomic <laughs> Dove. If you look on my web, you'll see I played right up till it happened. Okay, we got that. And he's kind of jealous of that, you know. That he's he jealous of your phone? Oh, yeah, he's jealous of me playing the web. I'm one of the top, top nations in the country. <laughs> Why are you driving so fast? I'm one of the top nations in the country. How are you going to be the nation? <laughs> Hold on, like. This is all the way wrong. I don't even feel like it's but Yes, I do. <laughs> if you in the U.S., this is like a nation, right? So, how are you the top nation in the country? I don't. I don't. That's the same thing. Like, <laughs> you could say I'm one of the top players in the country. I'm one of the top players in the nation, but I'm. <laughs> You are not the nation. He said, I'm one of the top nations in the country. Whew, man, bro. I promise you, I be like watching this sometimes. I love to watch this sometimes. All the time to be like 100 with you. Because when I'm sleepy and I'm blown at the same time and I'll just be laughing for no reason, I'll be saying some dumb shit. <laughs> I ain't even going to lie to y'all. But then it just satisfied me that people be on here dumber than me. You know what I'm saying? That's why I be liking to watch this. Going to my place right here. Step by a second. Yeah. Oh, nothing. Uh, All right. Okay. My shit. What's in that? Just my handkerchief. All right. <laughs> you going to jail? I'm telling you now, bro. These are just signs. I be look. Place right here. When Step you gotta a demonstrate what a napkin is for, oh, he said it's. Oh. Okay. My shit. What's in that? Just my handkerchief. All right. I guess I'll go my nose. Oh, wait. <laughs> Give me your hand. What is that? I don't know. Okay, he said it's a handkerchief to blow my nose because he had the dope in his, uh, up in the napkin. He boiled it up, to, you know, and just tried to put it back, bro. What else is up in there? Bro? You any more crack on it? No, sir. That's all you got? Yeah, I don't even do it. I you don't, don't do it. Got on me, yeah. You don't know how it got on you? Nope. Got some, uh, yeah. Usually somebody doesn't have that much that amount of crack on for their personal use. That's yeah, I don't even crack. use it. I okay, well you don't, don't use it. it so why, wh why do you have that amount? I don't for know. It? I don't even know how it got in my pocket. This guy's gonna be going to jail. He thought he was uh being cute, like he's blowing his hanky here and uh yeah. actually blew his crack onto the ground. How you blowing their own covers? One thirty fourth and the avenue on King. I've had a license plate number's vehicle in front of us. 
The registered owner is coming back suspended in third degree. So we're going to Bro, don't you hate when the police behind you? What's up, man? I'm Hey, uh, what's your name, CIO? Yes, sir. Yeah? Yes, sir. Oh, your driver's license suspended, man. When they got your door all the way open like that, you finna go to jail. And that look in his eye said, man, let me tell y'all something. Let me put y'all up on game real quick. If you ain't got no license or your tax expired, never drive in the left-hand lane when you in the street. You know what I'm saying? Always stay in the right-hand lane. So when the police get behind you or you see them two or three cars back, you can go ahead and pull in that jack of the box. You can go ahead and make a right on the street. You don't know where you're going. But you always can turn off the street as soon as you see them. But when you're in that left lane, and you want to make a left, and the police behind you, you got to wait on traffic. Now you probably have the light to make the left turn. If you do want to make a right, you got to get over another lane. The police going to be like, why are they trying to, as soon as I get them over here, they switching lanes real fast to make this right. Let me get up on them. If you ain't got none of that, stay in the right-hand lane. Listen to me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's how I stopped you. Even if you're driving down the street, bro. Get out and walk to the side of the car. The closest thing to you is a house. What are they driving? Why are you sitting down? Stand up. Okay. Why do you say sit down? Get up, bro. Oh. Oh. You're dumb. Why don't you go, get down, go down to the courthouse and get a... Uh, uh, concealed weapons permit. Yeah. He tried to hide that girl real quick. You can't afford it. For sixty dollars. Where are they at with the concealed weapons is is sixty dollars because I need to do what? This gotta be one of the throwbackiest videos I ever seen. Sixty dollars, I gotta look that up. But you know, we don't catch the bright ones. This one was no Einstein with a gun falling out of his pants and drugs in plain sight sitting here in the dashboard. Hey guys, what do you got? And uh, we got a, a subject. He's on uh, parole. So we got information that he's uh, selling methamphetamines out of his house. I know you want parole. Why you call him for that? <laughs> Get that hand back. Oh, oh. Hey. Oh. Oh. Take a deep breath. Okay. Oh. Oh. Why would you dump on me? That. I don't know if it's sir. Why are you getting all froggy when my partners are telling you to put your hands up? Keep them away from your what waistband. I am done with these, sir. Y'all see they have that Oh, oh there we go. Looky there. Y'all tell me for what reason. Oh, man. Would you dump on me? I don't know if it's sir. Why are you getting all froggy when my partners are telling you to put your hands up? Keep them away from your waistband. Y'all see that beam they just put on his back? That's what I want to know, bro. Why, if he's sitting down with his hands behind his back, and it's like three or four of y'all, all y'all got guns, why do you still got the gun pointed at his, not even at his front, just at his, just ready to do it. Like, hey, and he don't even know it. <laughs> Retrain the whole world. <laughs> We train our every every police force in the whole world because this is ridiculous. For real, bro. Awesome. I am done with these, sir. Oh, there we but go. When you, but when you Looky black there. and brown, then that's every day. Oh, by the way, know. you're under arrest. He, uh, by the way, you're under arrest. On parole. I'm trying to be cute for the camera. And uh, he jumped up. He wrapped up a looks like a stolen gun here. Going back to the pen. A few weeks, a few nights ago, one of our businesses here got broken into. Yes, sir. And I'll try to reach for challenges. you happened to what have that got to do with me? Some of the merchandise from that business right, right, in your right. car. Some of the oh, that's what they got to do with me. Work belts, tactical <laughs> work belts, and that's exactly what we have here. It's even got their uh, name on the box. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. Being a police officer is probably one of the most entertaining jobs you could have because I would be out there having the ball. Officer goes, bro, I'll be pulling you over just to measure with you. Like, whoop, be following you for like three miles with the sirens on. 
sweating bullets. If you, oh, you a fat boy, you weigh 250, you finna only weigh 200 today. <laughs> like, you lost 50 pounds with all that sweat. I'm gonna be following you for like five miles. You make a right, I make a right. You make a left, I make a left. Just following you, bro. <laughs> I ain't even pull me over. Here go my license, sir. I don't need that. What'd you put me over for? Nothing. Well, what's up? What's up? <laughs> I got two hours left. I'm bored, bro. I can... Huh? I didn't mean to say that out loud, but what's up? What'd you put me? Hey. You should just be happy you're not getting a ticket. So, what's up, dude? <laughs> And, you, and he ain't gonna get smart because you know I can give him a ticket, pull him out that car. Like, bro, he probably ain't got no license. So I'm just making him sit right there for five minutes. We just said, What's up, baby? Like, What's up, bro? What's up? Yeah, what's up? <laughs> and I've never committed a crime. There you go. You're get up on your leg. How'd you get on probation? I'll be out so many complaints, you bro. Volunteer for it? Volunteered. You volunteered to do Why every day probation? somebody say you pull an over to say what's yeah. up? Okay. And I'm supposed to believe that. So I started saying well, like so look. Maybe you'll go ahead on. and voluntarily uh, admit that you stole this stuff and voluntarily go to jail. We're gonna be uh, arriving a gentleman broke into somebody's house and called the owner of the home. <laughs> Alright now take away the sirens, take away the camera, take away the uniform. If this dude pulled up in his regular Chevy and his regular clothes trying to stop you from doing a burglary or whatever he about to go try to stop from doing, you finish. Bro, my your business. <laughs> Don't go, I will beat my your business. But it's no way you was finna stop me from doing what I'm doing, but. This is the reason why they joined the academy. We gotta feel like a look. I wanna feel like a man somehow. Cause ever since junior high, high school, I ain't. <laughs> Let me join the police force. Then I have real the brothers in blue. I mean. <laughs> Her to arrive with a, uh, <laughs> he's got a shotgun. He's waiting for her to come Man. home. So he has he broke in a window up by there's an apartment above the garage, no. and he called me from the phone, which is also a line in the house. Right. And then when he saw you guys coming, he left. Is Will home? What did I do? Come on. Oh, what did I do? You were in her house. Let's her start with that. Her window was open. It I, doesn't matter. You, you know, Okay, oh you went over. You went over to the house. Fuck. You called her from her house phone, told her that you're in waiting in her home with a shotgun. Bro, what kind of? I tell you, it's some stuff. <laughs> What's guess what? Racity. <laughs> what shoulder babies? It's just some stuff, bro. Like, how you gonna break in your girl house or somebody you stalking house? Then call her cell phone from her house phone. And say I'm in your house waiting on you with a burner. Like what? Okay, I'll be home. Is that what she's supposed to? No, I'm calling the police, bro. I know. I, I... <laughs> Done. I was there. I sat up there for about half an hour, and then I saw her window. Was you know, you know what we call that? My guy got his nips. Do you, do you even own a shotgun? Huh? Do you even own a shotgun? Yeah, but they're not in my house. Where are they at? They're at my dad's house in North Carolina. <laughs> So did you oh, tell her you funny. had one you today? Still to jail, though. Yeah, I did. You did just try and scare her or what? Yeah, pretty much. It was stupid. You talking to the police like it's gonna matter. You finna write that down, and now you can't even change your story when you get to the courthouse when the lorry come. None of that because you told the field officer that don't have no kind of jurisdiction, no kind of dictation of whatever happened to your case, bro. All they there to do is just to take you to jail. So when they tell you you got the right to remain silent, shut up. But then y'all want to go ahead and talk it, so they're going to pull that little notepad from right here. Write down everything you say and give it to the DA. Stupid. The BMA 26 years of age, black hair with all black clothing. He's also wearing a black hat. Any weapons on yourself? I didn't have no gun. No, I didn't say that. Do you have anything on you now? No. Okay. 
Do you got something now, though? I didn't have no gun. Where did you find all the credit cards? When I was walking right there. Oh, I hear you're scamming. What you mean? There's a robbery over there. And you found credit cards and stuff. And well, it was on the floor. I picked it up. If you see credit cards on the floor, you pick it up, too. What exactly happened? I Let's be English real. Very good. Okay. He was asking her for a purse. I don't speak English very good. And she said that very good. So, I, I, man. Do she think that we think the accent going to throw it off? I just understood everything you said. And right now, you speak it better than me. I am in here at 3.43 a.m. Blah. Wait. <clears throat> hey, ghost, you about to get up so weird. I don't care nothing about no y'all. If I could find the time. I don't even say the a.m. right here. 3.44 a.m. Why did I just, as a YouTuber, bro, I know you all, we all did this before. Let me tell you what's the most frustrating thing in the world that I almost thought I just did. <clears throat> did this whole video without pressing record. Just talking to a camera that ain't even on. I done did that like a million times already. I done, it's a group of videos I was supposed to do. I didn't even do them no more. Like... But yeah, she said that too good. First, he pointed a gun at her. Took what he wanted, mostly credit cards and the IDs out of the uh, wallet mm -hmm. from the purse. Ditched everything that he didn't want. That's when I got the call. So That's what he said he found it. Just told him, hey, dude, you want to stop for a second? That's where he started juking. Started running. That's why I started chasing after him. Both victims. And he didn't catch. 100% identified you as the suspect. Okay. Three. We have another pilot. Uh, three. Okay. And they saw a gun. They saw you shoot, hold the gun to their uh, to their person. All right, and then the the security guard saw you fire the gun. And you have the female victim's credit cards in your possession, hiding in the bushes. Oh yeah, you're going to jail. Yeah. Security you're going guard's to jail. actually doing a pretty good job keeping up with yeah, him. Yeah, he is. He is. There he's reaching in his pants. Yep. So he pulls out the gun Ooh. and shoots. See the muzzle. <laughs> yeah. And uh, wow, he turns and fires. I mean, he just missed. That's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> Your job too serious, bro. You are not. <laughs> you, you are not the police. This is what happens, bro. This is what happens. The security guard chased him. <laughs> the security. <laughs> The security guard chased him. <laughs> he was getting close. <laughs> so a boy pulled out the bag. <laughs> I'm not even... He's not even going to play with this thing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. So Bo so pulled out the burner and shot at him. <laughs> <laughs> Look. <laughs> Look. All right, and then the, the security guard saw you fire the gun. And you have the female credit <laughs> cards in your possession, hiding in the bushes near the crime. Yeah. The security guard's actually doing a pretty good job keeping up with yeah, him. Yeah, he is, he is. There he is, reaching in his pants. Yep. So he pulls out the gun and <laughs> see the muzzle flash. Yeah. And, uh, wow, he turns and fires. I mean, he just missed him. I mean... <laughs> There's an overwhelming amount of evidence against you. No! Back one of our deputies. No! Traffic stop. No! It's a good thing he missed because he would have been in there for life, okay, bro. Nothing I promise you. Answer? No. Uh -uh. All right. uh, <laughs> nothing stuff in your bar or anything no, like that? No. <laughs> you, you were in a bra, right? Man. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> the reason we're talking right now is because uh, you're, you're lying about your name and date of birth. Okay. Yeah, you are. Yes, he okay. is, bro. I guess I'm going to jail because that's my name. All right, sir, turn around. Thank you. Is that Mr. T on his wrist? Jesus. His wrist name is getting hard at all you rappers, bro. I okay. promise you. I guess you I'm going to jail because that's my name. Right, Look at that wrist. Turn around. Look at that wrist. Can you at least get me not wear this? No. Please. Which one's behind your back, sir? You tell us the truth and we can avoid all this. Is you're not 6'3", you're not 230 pounds, 
You're not that guy in that photo. I need you to be honest with me. <laughs> what is your real name? Let me put some clothes on. Okay. What do you have, yeah, on, B? That we will give you your clothes. Before we go in the car, right? Absolutely. You might not even be going to jail. Let me ask you this. Why would you lie about your name? Do you have warrants? Yeah. Why did he have an injury traffic collision where a vehicle crashed into a tree and the male driver fled the scene? Hey, He's wearing a blue jacket that says L.A., LA you know, like the, the L.A. Back. Dodgers, big letters, L.A. I'll stitch on the uh, Mexican guy, He's got a shaved head. One of my, one, one of the Mexican homies. This guy with the uh, L.A. jacket on that I just saw back here. 1932, I'll be out with suspect. What was that? Excuse me, suspect, what? Suspect what? Yeah, you excuse me, suspect what? <laughs> what you mean, suspect? <laughs> you Bro, you know you're going to jail. Sir, I did not. I got eyewitness that did see you. I don't know what you're talking about. My knee's kind of hurting, sir. Why is your knee hurting? Uh, I, I heard it earlier today. For the car crash. <laughs> you heard not it earlier today. Car down here? It was like a few minutes ago. And uh, I would say it's not drivable any longer. And then you saw him climb out of the car? And then I saw him climb directly out of the window. Okay. And stumble over here, kind of, and pull up his pants, and then walk out across the Hey, right, snitch, Dan. You already gave your description. Yeah, that's him. You know you're under arrest, obviously. Forrest, what are you up to, man? Forrest. I'm not doing anything. I know, but you're hanging in a place you shouldn't be hanging. I'm just asking for some change. Put your, put your, my, he tried oh, to get yeah. up out of there too. In there, I swear to God. I'm gonna get wiggly on everybody. Immediately, you see me. You go straight to your mouth, start chugging the water. Just thirsty. You got a couple down, right? I for your own health. For your own health. I'm serious. How many did you get down? Uh, a couple, buddy. It. It's all right. I've done it before. You just got okay. a triple wrap. It's about thirty three or four. Torn shirt and possibly blood on his face. She scratched your face? No, nah, she didn't scratch. She broke a mirror on my face. I, okay. I, I, she smoked my last cigarette. I told her not to. Is there a reason I'm being arrested when I've been? Anyway, that was it, man. Uh, I'm about to get me some sleep, man. I'm gonna be real with y'all. Hey, these videos in the morning, put them up, and yeah, keep running this marathon for the rest of my life, I guess. Y'all be careful. Y'all stay out the way. 90% of y'all seeing this video right now was sleep when I recorded this, bro. Y'all stay out the way. Be careful. Rest in peace. You can't Nipsey. TJ Ghost 100.